Hi, oh YouTube. My name is Dexter, and welcome to this Friday special edition of Dead Estate, where I'm going to be playing Fuji today. Uh, Fuji is interesting. She is the strongest woman in the world, kind of thing, and uh, she's pretty great. Um, great health, good mobility, fantastic damage, great rate of fire. There's no downside. Well, okay, that's not true. The downside is that she has to punch people. She can use no other weapons other than her fists. Um, but you know, 24 damage a shot, uh, double, uh, Jeff's damage, same health, and, uh, faster movement speed. And she also starts with destructive aura, which means I can just run through jars and break them. So I'm gonna try and get, a uh, uh, Fuji's, uh, secondary skin, which is called Senator Fuji, and it's exactly what you think it is. Um, it is exactly the Senator you think it's going to be. Uh, it's pretty great. Um, but the way you get it is by knocking out chunks on every single floor. Which, getting the true ending with her doesn't count as knockout. Doesn't count as a knockout for chunks. It is just, you have to actually punch them out on every single floor. Aw, oh, hell yeah! Love to see victory remains. But yeah, um, punch every single boss to death and you'll get, or punch chunks out every time he shows up and you'll get a new skin for her. And it's pretty phenomenal. Um, I've yet to do that. Uh, I've gotten the true ending with her because I figured, hey, let's let's get two or let's let's knock out two birds with one stone. Uh, I figured I'd be able to get the. Oh, I already went down that way. Figured I'd be able to get the skin for her and the true and complete the true ending at the same time. That yeah, doesn't work. Doesn't work that way. And it's very upsetting. <clears throat> And because the true ending, you technically fight chunks in that he shows up and tries to kill you, but then you do something that stops him from actually, you know, murdering you. And it's pretty great. Um, but yeah, that's uh, that, that that's really all there is to say about Lydia, or not Lydia, about uh, <laughs> I've been playing two or three rounds of Lydia. It has ended. Uh, surprise, surprise, on the second floor. Uh, like I said in the first episode, uh, of this, of, of Dead Estate that I recorded, the, my runs usually end on the first floor. Uh, or on the second floor for a while there. Or ended on the, the, the first floor for a while there, and it, it kind of sucked. Because, you know, it was a fun little game, fun little shoot -em up but, uh, the, 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 the actual... Ooh. Increase the chance of a cultist shop to appear. Hell yeah, I love cultist shops, even though I don't like not being able to see what I buy. Because, you know, every once in a while you accidentally buy a uh, uh, sepia tone or old film, whatever it is. And it just sucks. Being monochrome is just an awful feeling. Um. <clears throat> but yeah, that's something that uh, Fuji's able to do. Uh, hurling myself across... Uh... Oh, here he comes. Okay. Hey, Chunks, how you doing? Uh, yeah, I'll punch you to death. I don't mind. I got this. I can do this. 24 damage a swing? Hell yeah. Um, if you were looking for a tier list of characters, Fuji and Cordelia are both S tier. Um, because they just, they, they basically do the same thing. It's just Cordelia is able to stay a little bit safer, but Fuji does that much more damage. Fuji trades... Uh, safety for raw damage output, and, uh, Cordelia trades, uh, obnoxious amounts of damage for good mobility. She just has great kinds of damage. Um, uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's, uh, the, 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 the only characters that I really care to put on a tier list. S tiers are Fuji and Cordelia, if you were so inclined, because I know that was, uh, a meme for a while. What has what, what tier what's your tier list and it just you know there that that's my tier list for characters in Devastate and I'm objectively right. Enemies have a small chance to drop items. I love that item. It is great. So um, I believe bosses count as enemies. So if, if I get lucky, they might drop two items because you know I have the victory remains, so they're gonna drop something when I kill a boss. And also, I'm gonna go buy some damage. Maybe I should buy some max, or some health, but uh, I don't want all the damage. I want to punch harder. So yeah, I've gone from doing 24 damage to 28. It's like a 20-ish percent increase. 
Yeah, bring it on! Doesn't matter what boss it is, I'm gonna punch it in its punk mouth. Even if it doesn't have a mouth, I'll find one. I'll find a reasonable facsimile thereof and punch it there. <clears throat> yeah, down it goes! Hell yeah, King's Crown! Um, you know what? Let's go buy some... more damage. Throwing hands harder is what I want. <clears throat> uh, no. I thought I saw a, a second door over there, but I was wrong. Um, yeah, it was a... Was it the boss fight room? What was over here? Yeah, okay, that's the boss fight. Alright. <clears throat> and by boss fight, I mean the boss rush. Uh, not really any reason to go do it. Or, well, mm, I say that. There might be a reason to go do it. it. It has five or six items inside it. Which is, you know, always worth. Or maybe worth. Um, but I always check for strange lumps. Will do. <sighs> ah, excuse me. Don't know why I'm so tired all of a sudden. Just kind of Sam I decided he needed to pay a visit. But, uh, alright. So, um... How much more damage do I do now? 31, hell yeah. I mean, it's a little less damage than uh, the first upgrade, but, you know, doing 31 a punch instead of 28 or 24 is definitely a huge boon. Um, and, you know, like I said, uh, good fire rate, good damage, great health, good mobility, everything that, or everything Fuji does is just great. Um, the only problem is you gotta get kinda close. But she has that dash that my brother had no idea you could do for the longest time. Um, what do you got for me? Brass Knuckles. Ooh, I want it. Melee weapons do extra damage half of the time. Fist-type weapons do even more extra damage. I want the roids and I want the Brass Knuckles. Uh, well, maybe I should just go for the Marks the Spot and the Brass Knuckles. But I'll save, I can't save up the money. Also, is that chunks roaring at me, or is that just something shaking elsewhere? I really don't like this cage. Oh, I thought I saw a fake door over there. Alright, or a secret door, not a fake door. Alright, well, that's a little upsetting. Guess it was just him... Yeah, it was just him vomiting stuff at the wall. Alright. Bang. Um. Oh, there is a secret down here. Sweet. Hey, guess what happens when Fuji picks up weapons? She breaks them immediately. She actually can't use anything. If it's not a fist weapon, she can't use it. More accurately, she refuses to use it, but... You know, let's go with she can't. Because it's funnier that way. Alright, there's Chunks. Bring it on, nerds! Cultist nerds! Bully the nerds! Hi, cultist shop. Maybe the fuzzy dice was a bad idea. Um. <clears throat> and now, what kind of shenanigans can I get into? What kind of special items can I find over this end? Nothing! I don't like this room. The Homestuck rejects make me very upset. And the fact that I lost two health in here is not something I'm happy about. All right, chunks, when are you gonna show up? When are you gonna when are you gonna come try and fight me? Cause I want the money. Bring it on, you rat! I want your I want your lunch money, nerd. All right, what do we got going on over here? More money. Can't even use it. My fist pack more of a punch than any puny gun ever could. All right. Um, you know what? Let's go back and try and buy it now. And by try, I mean let's just go buy it now. Because, uh, you know, I don't actually have to walk everywhere. I can rocket punch. And it's great. Every time I, every time I play Fuji, uh, if my brother's watching, I do that at least once a run. And he always just says, stop cyberbullying me. Whatever. Something similar. Stop being toxic. <laughs> it's, uh, pretty funny. 
We have a fantastic relationship. Brass Knuckle X marks the spot. Let's go. Let's go! Big damage. Come on. Get in here, you ugly bitch. Ow. Well, I walk into that one. But whatever, I got plenty of health. And I do obnoxious damage. Sometimes. I actually don't know how uh, that, that damage modifier is actually going to work. Um, or if it's going to work at all on chunks. And I got to scratch my nose something fierce. I'm sorry about that. Unpause the game! <laughs> no. <laughs> my nose was really itchy. I'm sorry. My mustache is tickling it. I do I do enjoy Chunks' uh, little uh, bits and bobs when you, you you pause the game, the little bits of flavor text. They're, they're pretty great. My favorite one is just Puny Wimp. Oh, I like the star. If he ever, you know, actually shows up, but sometimes he just doesn't want to. Sometimes he says, nah, working too hard. Um, oh, I guess it has to be a, a new room. All right, well, that's a little upsetting. But you know what? We got a little bit of health out of it. We killed a man. Uh, and by man, I mean a ground mouth. And I want to go see what's in the challenge room. Because I want to see exactly how the brass knuckles work. I know it's just a percent chance for big damage, but I'm still gonna punch people, but I'm not gonna take the tiny wall. The tiny wall is awful. <clears throat> Alright, how much extra damage is that extra damage? If it ever, you know, triggers. I don't think it's gonna trigger for me. She doesn't appear that she wants to. And that's a little upsetting. Ow. Should have bought the roids. But I didn't. Alright, Tiny Wallet. Limits you to $500, but grants you a boost in damage, or speed and damage boost when you reach that limit. I'd rather just have, you know, an obscene amount of money. Uh, hey, cool, look at that. Hey, uh, speaking of obscene amounts of money. Now, um... We're gonna leave. And then... We're gonna go buy some stuff. We're gonna go buy an Ambrosia if I'm close enough to the... Yeah, I'm close enough. All right. <clears throat> All right, time to go purchase that Ambrosia. Wait, was there? No, because I have the X marks the spot. It wouldn't have been there. It's not there. Fuji, what you been up to? Because Fuji and Cordelia are very good friends. One might even say the best of friends. One might even say they're actually dating because that was a, you know, that was a statement from their, their Twitter account, I guess, when the, the game... Uh, I guess got popular? Sure, let's go with that. And bring it on, Idol of Worship. I'll scramble an egg, no problem. Ooh, look at me go! Look at, these, look at me dance! Look at me dance! Can I break it in one go? Yeah! Causes some pots to explode on destruction. Hell yeah! I'm gonna be unstoppable! And then IED, let's go. Upward and onward. I hope knocking chunks out on every floor that he spawns on doesn't mean that I have to go through all the secret areas as well. Or not the secret areas, but the alternate alternate floors. Because that'd be a little annoying. Because that would mean go do the, 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 the true ending, but not collect anything. Which is not what I want to do. Leave me alone, Night Stalker, you ugly bitch. I really don't like this thing. Bang! I don't know what exactly he's supposed to be, I just know that he's called the Night Stalker. And he lives up to his name, he definitely stalks the night. Alright, what are you? Sure, I'll throw another punch as soon as I punch somebody, hell yeah. Because that's what this means. If, you, if I kill somebody with a haymaker, I'll throw another haymaker immediately. And it's <laughs> kind of funny. It definitely does an obscene amount of damage. I'm already doing an obscene amount of damage, but this will just make that even better. Money! I love money! Money, 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 money. Bring it on, Spiderfoot. 
dandy long leg. I honestly don't know what exactly this thing's supposed to be. I, it just reminds me of the, the giant spiders from, uh, 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 Pikmin. And the bane of my existence. Ow. So I've come to the conclusion that I think my good friend Mr. Brass Knuckle here might be broken. As in, it's non-functioning. Because I haven't seen... Um... Any extra damage. I've just been doing 31s. So I'm starting to think that this doesn't work. <coughs> Excuse me. Because it says half the time, which to me sounds like a 50-50, but I've not seen any extra, any numbers higher than a 31 in quite a while. More damage. Alright, we fixed the problem. Now I'm doing 35, I think it said. Yeah, 35. 35 swing. Very glad I didn't pick up that toilet paper. Very, very glad I didn't pick Hey, Chunks, how you doing, bud? Ow. Alright, I'll go over here. I don't want to deal with Chunks and the Daddy Long Legs. And the Spider Stomp or whatever you want to call it. I'll just punch Chunks. Punch, 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 punch. Bite it, big man, bite it! Uh, I mean, I shouldn't tell a giant rat to bite my fist, because he probably will. Rats are... Feral rats are kind of assholes. I'm glad to know that enemies maintain their maximum, or their current health every time you leave a room. That's, that's nice to know. There's that guy dead. And there's him dead. I have killed the nerds! I have killed the cultists. Ow, I hate fighting the meat cubes as Fuji and Digby. They both have the same problem. Because, you know, having to get close enough to smack a suicide bomber does not work very well for your longevity. It's just kind of annoying. Fortunately, uh, my, my ghost bolts work really well on, uh those weird masks, so that's something. Let's go bully a nerd. Yeah, bully him into the corner. Bully him, yeah! <laughs> I don't know what else to call what I'm doing to people. I'm just gonna keep calling it bullying them, because that's that's kind of, you know, appropriate. Flamethrower! Man, I really should go play some TF2 sometime soon. I haven't played that game in years, and I kind of miss being the Pyro. The Pyro, Demo, and Heavy were my favorite characters. Yes, I do like to hold... Yes, I do like not thinking. Why do you ask? Alright, get down here, spider foot. Piss off, Spider-Man! Yeah! Alright, Cornelia, what you got for me? Hopefully it'll be something cool, like, you know, damage or more health or something. Uh, I definitely want the glory box, but right now it makes more sense for me to have the ambrosia, because I'm Kind of hurting. Um, if I could find a heart worm, I'd be very happy. Get down here. Get punched. I almost... Well, okay. Look at that. I totally know what I'm doing. I totally dodged everything flawlessly because I was paying attention and wasn't just a complete fluke. I'm actually just the greatest gamer of all time. Um... <clears throat> yeah. That's totally it. Ow, bastard. I thought I jumped over his shots. I was wrong. Alright, get down here, meat thwomp. And I guess I'll go... Well, I'll go see what the challenge room actually has in store. Uh, I don't plan on dropping down to one health, so I'm not going to waste my time with it. Uh, we're just going to go back and say hi to Cordelia and maybe buy some Max Health. I almost walked into that toilet paper again. Yeah, Max Health. Why not? I'd, li I'd rather have... Oh, okay. So it gives me two extra instead of one. Alright, I'm, I'm okay with it. Yeah, I like being more durable. Nothing wrong with that in the slightest. Alright. 
Woo. All right, bring it on. Um, fragile fool, calling it right now. Nope, I was wrong. You know what? I'd rather deal with the natal leviathan. Way easier. Because he's, you know, he just sits there and lets me punch him. He might have more health than the fragile fool, but, you know. There, look at that, he's dead. What'd you drop? Ooh, I like gold coins, hell yeah. Please leave me alone. The only thing I don't like about the natal leviathan is that that ball follows you forever, and it sucks! Alright, <clears throat> back... To the lab we go. Back to the lab again. Add exactly. I had to think about where we were actually headed because it, you know, just. I'm so used to doing the true ending now that it's just kind of like, alright, yeah, floor three does not go to the lab, but yes, it does. Uh, but alright, laboratory. Back to the lab again. Piss off, slug pig. And whatever you are, blue mouth, that, that's. That's your new name, Blue Mouth. Congratulations, you've been upgraded from whatever you actually call to Blue Mouth. Very surprised I was able to jump over his uh, shot. Hup. Oh, <laughs> it hit the wall behind him. Sweet. All right, what you got for me? Money! I love money. I don't want money. I want money. <laughs> I wish I could remember what uh what movie that was. I just know it from a Jello Apocalypse video from a long time ago. Uh. Reviewing movies in ten words or less in one of the reviews was I don't want money. I want money Which I totally understand I totally get I'd rather have money over money Leave me alone. Just just I hate these things. I Hate those spiders because they don't ever stop moving Generate a little money as long as you're at 1 HP in a room full of enemies. Sweet. Alright, what do you got for me? Damn right I want the weird syringe. More damage and fire rate? Hell yeah. I gotta punch some sludge pigs and some weird spiders for it, but you know what? I'm okay with that. Maybe I'm not okay with it, because I can't actually, you know, hit them. Please, just die for me. And do not throw any more of them at me. I'm okay with dealing with mini chunks. And weird fart breath, but... Crying spiders? Hell no. Yeah! I'm almost dead, but you know what? <clears throat> it's worth it. It's not worth it, actually, in the slightest. I very much shouldn't have done that. Um... Trying to deal with the spiders was my worst decision. Um, <clears throat> but it's just... Why? Uh, well, I, um... Ah, very close. Very close. Where the hell is he going? Please die. Yeah, 53 damage a swing? Hell yeah. Look at how fast I punch. Uh, I actually gotta pay attention now. Instead of just, you know, throwing haymakers wildly. Because anything that hits me, I die. And this is how a lot of my Fuji runs have gone. It's just kind of, man, this 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 goes real well until I get to this floor and then I have to deal with the, uh, the flying bullshit. And by flying bullshit, I mean the spiders. Piss off, fart breath. Alright, Cordelia. I'm almost dead. <laughs> Give me the Ambrosia. Give me the Gemini. Now I throw... I think... I could be wrong, but I think Gemini might let me throw two hands at the same time? Might be wrong. Might be wrong on that one. But... I think I get two hands now. Every once in a while, I'll throw two fists. I'd say pay attention to the numbers, but they come and go so fast that I don't think that's, you know, feasible. Ow, bastard. <clears throat> Money! Money! All the money! Alright, bring it on, Chunks. I want to punch you. I want to punch you a lot. 
Well, my uh, my star killed that thing. Good job, star. <clears throat> hey, look, it's everybody's least favorite monster, the crying spiders. <laughs> so here and gone. It's fantastic. That almost ruined my run. All right, what do we got uh, for an elevator here? Don't need to do the boss rush. I kind of, yeah, I kind of want to, but at the same time, I don't need to. I just want to get in and out real fast. I say that as I've been in here for 25 minutes already. So uh, maybe I'm a liar. <clears throat> Wee. Wee. Oh, hey, chunks. <laughs> now, can I kill him before he reaches me? No, no, I cannot. That is upsetting. Well, I almost did. <laughs> Hell yeah. And that's how it's done, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, what else did Cordelia have? I know I only paid attention to the, uh, whatever it is there. Ambrosia. Second chance, the vault. Yeah, I don't need that. We're not gonna need that where we're going. Not gonna need any of that. Alright. <clears throat> now let's go punch Chunks a second time. After I kill this boss. I'm gonna call it right now. It's gonna be, uh, uh Cecil. Er, Sybil. Not Cecil. Sybil. Yeah. Get punched, sister! Ow. Uh, <laughs> Fun sticks, yay! <laughs> oh god, this is such a stupid build. I mean, it's entirely because of the funky syringe. Let's not get it twisted. My build is just the funky syringe. <clears throat> and also the, the three damage upgrades, but beyond that, pretty bog standard. Nothing else works together. It's just I'm throwing hands at Mach 9 because I'm the world's strongest woman. Punch. Alright, what you got for me? <gasps> Liquid luck. I mean, it's not... May maybe it'll come... Maybe it'll actually trigger my... Whatever it's called there. I've got plenty of guns right here. Hell yeah. It might trigger my... Hello. Knuckle... Finally, but I doubt it. Ooh. Um, don't need any of that. All right. <clears throat> hey, let's hang out later. Damn right. Whee. All right. So I don't really need the money. I don't know why I'm walking over here. I guess I kind of want to try and get some more max health, but I don't think I'm really gonna need it. Um, but uh. All right, here we go. Boss fight time. Whee. Those chains are no match for my fists, but I don't want to desecrate a grave. Everybody has something weird to say about the, uh, the coffin there. <coughs> my favorite is, uh, I think might be the bosses, which is, I don't have time for grave robbing. But all right, bring it on, Chunks. Half hour in and out, I'd say that's pretty good. Except, you know, uh, there's an achievement for uh, getting in and out in uh, 15 minutes or less. And by getting in and out, I mean actually winning in 15 minutes or less. All right, bring it on, Chunks. I'll sit over in the corner. I find it very strange that my, my punches pull me towards wherever I'm swinging. Let's bully Chunks into the corner. I'm just gonna keep throwing hands. He can't stop me. Alright, I take that back. He can definitely stop me. Thanks! There. I'll make an exception for this one. <clears throat> Beautiful. And that might not be the skin unlocked, but we'll find out here in a little bit. But that's, uh, you know, that's how you bully Chunks into a corner. And... <laughs> You just play Fuji, you get the funky syringe, there it is, the candidate! As Fuji, knock out chunks on every possible floor that you visit. You unlock Fuji's bee costume. And yeah, she just sits cross-legged on a, uh, on a, uh, broomstick, and I find that very funny. But there we go! Hit to death! Beat the game as Fuji. There we go. Achievement unlocked. But there, that's, uh, that's how, that, that, that's a run as Fuji. Throw hands, 
and put people in the ground. It's pretty phenomenal. She is one of the best characters for a reason. Her only only downside is that, you know, fists, but you know, you don't need anything else. <laughs> I like it. But all right, there we go. I uh, hope you all enjoyed this, and I will see you all uh, next week. I hope you enjoy your weekend, and I'll catch you all on Monday. Bye, everybody. It's been a ton of fun.